like all these years and I didn't know like that he had my heart. But he's gonna be over later. Try to sneak a little picture or something and tell me what you think, okay? I'm nervous, oh my God. So here's a bit of the background, okay? When I was younger, um, he and I had like this special like romance thing going on. But I think like with my Italian background, his Russian background, they grew up in the times of the Cold War. They didn't want me to hang around, you know, this Russian friend that I made when I was like 14, 15. I mean, he was immediately, we just had this special bond and I just knew it was going to be like a lifetime of love. Today after work, I put on a little makeup. I just had like this intuition, like, and sure enough, I went to the store and like, there he was. And it was like, whoa. It's been 15 years, of course we've both changed, but like I recognized him right away. And I, it's weird because like I always thought he was so gorgeous, but like actually he's kind of basic to Russians. Like when I saw him, I was like, oh my God. I just like fell in love all over again, but he's here y'all. So I gotta go like, make sure I look okay. Oh, I'm so nervous. I mean, you gotta let him wait, but you don't wanna let him wait. You know what I mean? So here it goes. Privet, it's so nice to see you. Oh my God, it's been so long. <laughs> Way too long since I've been reunited with triple distilled Russian standard vodka. My absolute love of my life. I thought it was a very deep and touching story. So for Amanda Padolins to call me a dick, you don't know love, Amanda.